All right, started day four and fatigue is setting in because we didn't get up till about an hour and a half later than usual. But we got Jamie in the boat today. Um, but yeah, conditions have changed drastically from the last two days, I'd say. It was cloudy, a little bit of a breeze, chop on the water, uh, no wind, and sunny today. So uh, we're thinking that might start pushing some more fish into the weeds, but we will find out. I think we're going to start on some rock spots and just start checking things as the day goes on. That's what we're going to do. What's she doing? Breast stroke? <laughs> what? Is this like... She's like playing with you, dude. This is like game time. Oh, you wanna play games? <laughs> it's like a half hour later. It's like, oh yeah, I won't have footage anymore. Just so I can watch Oh, there was a fish. Just swirled back by your bait. Came up and went back down. That's why I kept my bait in the water. I, I knew... Well, that's annoying. Now we've seen a fish. I knew if I just kept my bait in the water, that Look, it was a nice one. From the tail. Yeah, <laughs> that's I about all I, I saw. I saw it. I'm right next to you. Just, I mean, just flashed up for a second. That the most unexciting follow ever. Yeah. I didn't see the swirl. I didn't see nothing. I just saw it. I just looked I just, at your... It didn't, didn't even come up high enough to boil the water. Yeah, I was, look, I was watching... Looking kind of down at your bait and my bait, and I yeah. just didn't see it. It's just probably out of the corner of your view there. This fits the upright, it's good. All right, well, after a pretty unsuccessful morning, we maybe saw two fish this morning. It was pretty slow but we had a really significant weather change. It went from cool and breezy to sunny and relatively calm. So most of the fish we were seeing were out on the rocks, which makes sense for those conditions that we had. And now that we've had the sun, uh, it's warmed up throughout the day. Just got done with dinner, so we are coming out for the afternoon and we're gonna target weeds and hopefully we can find some muskies. Push us Say, I thought I got hit a couple times there. Mr. Way Too Tiny Northern. Well, that is a far cry from the 40 plus inch muskie we're looking for. Took a blast at it. Yeah. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Yeah, a little pikey. Did you see him? No, I didn't see him. Yeah. I was just trying to steer clear of the weeds. Yeah, he, he followed it in a little bit. 
we definitely found a little little pike sanctuary. There's muskies back here though. It's gotta be. Alright, something I haven't used that much on this trip yet. Shum shum quickie. See if I can get it through the reeds and the weeds here in this shallow stuff we're targeting these fish in. Yeah, I had a fish on the glide bait there. Huh. I'd like to think that was something bigger, but could have just been one of our little friendly pike. All right, well, day five was terrible. Um, there's nothing more to say about it than that, I guess. The weather switched, it got really nice out, it was beautiful out, but the wind and the clouds and everything was putting fish into predictable spots for us. And that all went away. Hopefully the warm weather will push them into the weeds where we can find them. So here is a quick recap of day five. Oh, there was a fish. <laughs> took a blast at it. Yeah. See, nothing really exciting happened. Um, Yep, that's it. We're going to roll it right into day six. Wish us luck tomorrow. We hope it's better. I'll talk to you later. Good night. <laughs>